TTC 101 Back to the Basics How to Discern Your Cervical Mucus As your cycle progresses, your cervical mucus increases in volume and changes texture. The changes in the cervical mucus reflect where you are at in your cycle. Before ovulation the first few days following menstruation, there will be little or no discharge present. You will feel dryness around your vulva. During this time, chances of getting pregnant are low. Approaching ovulation. The first discharge to appear should be moist and sticky and white or cream in color. In the finger test, where you take some of your cervical mucus be fingers before, between your fingers like so, and pull apart your fingers, the mucus should break easily. You should only be able to pull your fingers apart approximately one centimeter before it breaks. During this transition time, first the mucus will become cloudy and slightly stretchy during the finger test, meaning it still breaks before the fingers are stretched all the way. As time progresses, the cervical mucus will become greater in volume. right around ovulation. You are considered most fertile when your cervical mucus becomes clear, slippery, and stretchy. Some women compare the cervical mucus to raw egg whites. Finger testing will allow the cervical mucus to stretch several centimeters before it breaks, if it breaks at all. The amount of this thin mucus will steadily increase until you experience your mucus peak. This occurs the last day of the period right after, right at ovulation. During this phase, sperm survival rate is high and can survive in the cervical mucus for up to 72 hours. After ovulation. At this point, there is a marked change in the cervical mucus appearance. It returns to the sticky stage where it doesn't stretch with the finger test and again there's dryness around the vulva. Please note, this information may not apply to all women, particularly those who suffer from anovulation, those with vaginal infections, those on certain medications including birth control, for these conditions can alter cervical mucus. Also, sometimes sperm or semen can be confused with cervical mucus, so be sure not to test your cervical mucus too closely around intercourse. Always remember to consult a doctor if you have any serious questions or concerns regarding this topic.